Nice shot. Ooh. That's a steal. That's a steal. Relax the gear, relax the gear, relax the gear. Call Piaco, that's a jig. I'm an ISO, I'm an ISO. Jesus Christ! I'm gonna do it, brother. Bucket! It's your boy Jago here, and today I'm bringing to y'all one of the best all around builds in 2K23, in my opinion at least. Because if you know how to shoot, you know what I mean? If you know how to attack the basket, and if you know how to play defense, this build is the build for you, especially if you want to be the primary ball handler. I swear to you, I've been running rank, um, played a couple games in the park. And I've been using this build as the primary ball handler. Um, I've had no problems. If anything, I've had advantages uh, over anything. So we're going to get right into it, man. So we, we go small forward, um, right-handed, jersey number 14, whatever, whatever. The height, we go 6'6", six, six, weight, 204, wingspan, 7'3", body type doesn't matter. I went to find, it looks good. Um, and to the stats so for the stats we get 11 finishing badges once you do my career a couple quests in my career you get that plus four so you'll be 15 and then once you get 15 remember it takes five badges to get a bronze core badge so my goal is to get limitless takeoff on silver so once i get the plus four right that's 15 you can core that and then if you hit 39 in any season, you can get six, right? So when you get that six, level 39, by the end of the season, you have silver, limitless takeoff. Anyways, we went with 70 driving layup, um, an 80 dunk. 80 dunk gives you a lot of the one off one athletic dunks. It gives you the quick drop. Um, you can get Clyde <laughs> Drexler's dunk package as well as uh, you get a good amount of stuff with an 80 driving dunk but you gotta pair the 80 driving dunk with a 60 vertical but we talk about that anyways we put nothing on standing dunk because we're a guard nothing on post control we go 78 midi 83 ball 74 free throw 86 pass accuracy 88 ball handle 88 speed with ball and 88 ball handle is not bad you still get a good amount of six 86 according to 2k lab for pass accuracy 86 is like equivalent to a gold bullet passer so that's why i went 86 you know some people go lower but i'm the main main ball handler and i'm a pass first guard so i want to be able to get my passes off in a timely manner 88 ball handle that gives you um dimer well no i'm tripping that gives you handle for days on silver um killer combos on gold and hyperdrive on gold. So it gives you a good amount of stuff. And you also get unpluggable on gold. Um, speed ball 88, not bad at all. I don't feel so when I have the ball, to be honest. The speed boost is pretty fast. Um, we went 52 interior defense, 86 perimeter, so we can get that gold clamps. No, I'm tripping. So we can get that silver clamps. Um, 
um, we went 90 steel just because we want this build to be a two-way build, man. We trying to with this build, we trying to play make, hit our shots, get um, take good dunks, and we we also trying to be a menace on defense, bro. We trying to be a menace on defense. We trying to be these point guards' worst nightmare. So we got a 52 interior defense, 86 perimeter defense, 90 steel, 70, 72 block. What, what you get with the 72, 72 block is silver chase down. I don't know how good it's, it is yet. I haven't upgraded my player to that far where I can say, oh, silver chase down is all you need. I'm not going to lie. I don't know. So far, bronze chase down has been trash. I'll be honest with you. But the only thing about this build is you also get some bronze anchor which should up blocks the paint so i'm telling you bro max style this build will be a menace to smaller guards and i cannot wait to max this man out and get all my core patches and inevitably this shit will put up your um defensive rebounds to 41 for no reason I, you know honestly i don't know why some of these things correlate but whatever y'all ain't here to hear me talk speed 84 acceleration 86 i will say I'm used to a faster player, but this game is so slowed down and so much more slow, slow paced that an 84 speed at a PG position is not bad. It's not bad at all. Acceleration, we went with 86. Strength, 40. I said fuck strength because, like, I'm playing point guard. How many point guards about to bully me? Not a lot, unless it's some big ass, it's some big ass, unless somebody had my idea but went taller, you know what I mean? But even then, it ain't going to be easy. Because um, I've been running a lot of wreck, and so far in the wreck, I've been a demon on defense, but, you know what I mean? Y'all can tweak the build to y'all liking, but I'm telling you, this build is nice, and y'all gonna see we're going to get a shade of PG, shit is lit, you know what I mean? But, anyways, and then we went 93 um, stamina, man, so... If y'all wanted my bill, follow. If y'all want my bill to the exact measurements, this is my numbers. Y'all follow that exactly. But if y'all want to tweak it, like for say, if y'all feel like y'all could go a little lower on acceleration, or you know what I mean, a little lower on stamina, or let's say y'all don't even give a fuck about dribbling like that, yeah, you know I mean, I could go lower. So it's up to y'all. But I'm telling you, this bill right here, bruh. Only thing I would change is I wish I had got more finishing badges, but finishing badges are expensive this year, so it is what it is. This build is straight. Dunks are hard to block, so 80 driving dunk is really all you need. You do not need that. Um, you do not need that 84, or you you don't need contacts. You don't. You really don't. But you know your boy gonna make a build that you got contacts eventually. But it is what it is. Point is, this build took me like a whole day to make, bro, because I didn't want to. Every year, I usually make a bum first build, and I was determined, alright, I was determined this year to get it right, and here we got 11 finishing, 19 shooting, 26 playmaking, 18 defense, bro, this is a good two-way build, um, I went extreme clamps and boost teammate rating, but boy, I am going to change it as soon as I get mama mentality. <laughs> But, but you know take over don't matter it's up to y'all um and as y'all can see we're gonna get us a shade of anthony edwards gerald wallace and paul george so not a bad build bro and we get a dope ass name two-way three-point point forward come on bro that shit just sounds cool that shit just sounds cool so if y'all want to have some fun, man, y'all seen the clips in the intro. Y'all seen that this build can do it all, bro. It is a very good build. Like, I, do, I want that to be known. I don't want y'all to think like I'm bringing y'all some man, mediocre build. This shit is a very good build, bro. Y'all wouldn't be disappointed. It's a great all-around build. One of the best all-around builds, in my opinion. Um, yeah, man, so... If this video helped you out, if y'all already made this build, or y'all plan on making this build, or came across this build, or shit, if y'all think this build trash, let me know in the comment section, bro. Let me know. Let me know what y'all feel about this build, bro. And we gonna be going crazy this year with the 2K content, bro. So if y'all want me, my fan, fuck it, man. If y'all enjoyed the video, like the video, bro. But if y'all feeling so generous, drop your boy a sub, man. You know what I mean? If y'all feel so generous. 
Anyways, I'll catch y'all boys. Be easy. I hope y'all are having as much fun on 2K as I am. And your boy is out. Peace.